Vegas. Something's going on over here. I think they're trading a bike. Or he just stole his bike. Not sure what's going on. Anyway, uh, welcome to Las Vegas. We're back. Hope everyone had a great uh, Thanksgiving. Let's see if I can get this thing to work right. Good to have you all here. Let's see what we got here tonight. Great Dane Mom. Got Gales here. Got to Aces 8. Aces 8s. Who else we got here this evening? Good to have you all. We got Rob Wall. And I'm trying to flip through real quick. Intel Wild, how you doing? Holistics here. Poker Junkie. Southside the English Hotel. I'm going to park here, but I wanted to show you the update on the artwork that's being done. Let me pull this off to the side here. Show you what's going on now. Some sort of bike transaction going on over here. <laughs> but uh, this is the artwork. Our uh, pros is our guy here. Intel Wild, Coach Steve. <laughs> Thank you for the $5 super chat. Great to have you here. Uh, take a look at this. So we did the view, the, the uh, three videos on, uh, I think it was Wednesday, when he started doing the work. And uh, Tuesday and Wednesday. And here's where he's at so far. And there's a feral cat. And here comes a car. Oh, the cat made it. I wonder, wonder, wonder what we're asking for the bike over here. Anyway, I just wanted to show you. Sorry. This is, uh, I got Ernesto's in here. How cool. So anyway, this is all being done by spray paint. He's using spray paint cans to create all this art. And the art that was selected are pieces that he actually created, sent it to us, and uh, was selected by the ownership group on which ones they wanted. But just amazing what this gentleman's doing with spray paint cans. I mean, just bringing it to life. And this is at the corner here of Main Street and Coolidge in Las Vegas. You can see the entire hotel down that way. And then of course down this way as well. So just want to update you on that. I think what we'll do is we'll actually jump into the vehicle and head down towards Fremont Street. It's fantastic. It's, it's excellent. It's outstanding is what it is. Uh, definitely looks 3D. I mean, real good depth on it. Really cool imagery just such a great job uh, putting that all together sorry about the bounciness there for a few moments but we will get situated we've got uh 11 things on a paper plate and we had a, some suggestions on what to do with that so i've got some of those uh, it's just uh, an amazing piece of work that he's done Holistic, how are you doing tonight? Let's see here. We've got the phone in the car. We're going to head down towards Fremont Street. Got the bands playing tonight. There's no Raiders tonight. So uh, it's other football teams been playing. Hopefully you all had a great Thanksgiving. I know it's been a couple of minutes since we all talked. And uh, I got, had an opportunity to go out to Texas, hang out with the kids, family. And I uh, had a real good time out there. Unfortunately, there really wasn't anything to show or to go visit. It was a little bit rainy and cold. Uh, let's see, it has been a while. Um, but we are here now, we're ready to go. So I think the bike transaction is over. I'm not sure what they're purchasing or selling over there, but hey, it is what it is. Back in Vegas, just got back in a few minutes ago, pulled in, dropped off the luggage, uh, did a few things, came down here to look at the sculpture picture, and here we go. So let me know where you're watching from, drop it into the chat. Let me know what uh, if you had turkey or ham or both, any of that kind of stuff. It'd be great to catch up and uh, what part of the world you're in. That's always good to know. A little chilly here tonight. It's 60 degrees, but it's not cold. Holistics in Calgary, Canada. Cool. Kino and Kangan had ham. We had both. We had a uh, honey baked ham. Oh my goodness. Tyrone, Pennsylvania. Intel Wild had turkey, no ham. Uh, Holistic loves all food. Is there a poutine for uh, Thanksgiving in Canada? Hassan Terrell, how are you doing? Good to have you here. Ernesto is baking. Erie, Pennsylvania tonight. We're from work. Tons of snow. Wow, Beth. Okay. Got some SoCal's in here. Tucson will be on Fremont Street December 18th. Oh, cool. Steve Rogers, uh, and, and thank you for your service to our country as, uh, as Captain America. We appreciate that. Bill's here from Latrobe, Pennsylvania. Turkey and baby back ribs. A.G. Jordan, I should come to your house. 
Uh, I ate tons of leftovers. In fact, we got stopped at the airport this morning. My wife had packed a bunch of the leftovers. And uh, when I went through, I was doing her luggage and they said, do you have any food or beverage in the uh, bags? I said, no, of course not. Not realizing she'd stuffed it full. Uh, so we ended up getting an extra screening for that. So that was, that was a lot of fun. See, all right, cool. A couple of PA folks tonight, yep. Vancouver, BC, Turducken. Oh, the best. Turducken, Duncan. <laughs> Uh, I had I had a taste of that last year. Ugh. Good stuff. I do have a brand new gimbal. So I uh, went out and splurged on Black Friday and picked up a uh, really nice piece of equipment, which we'll uh, put into service today. We'll see how it goes. We are back in Vegas, August Ice. You betcha. Hello from Bellevue, Washington. Denise Sexton. 55 degrees, turkey dinner for Whole Foods. Cool. Uh, Gail had a TV dinner. Uh, hopefully it was the turkey with the uh, cranberry sauce and the stuffing. I love that one. Tur turkey, duck, and chicken. Turduncan. Philip, how you doing? Good to have you here. We're back. Back in Vegas. After uh, spending the holidays with a lot of people. It's a good time. And uh, I got to hang out with some cats. Great Dane Mom at Waffle House. Nice. Very nice. Hanging out with cats and a dog. They're fun when they're at someone else's house. Had a pit bull, a uh, young one. I think he's only three years old. And then, of course, the cats had a real, uh, real young cat and then an older cat. Of course, we put a few short videos out on, from them. I wanted to be one of those internet cat guys. John, how you doing? From New York with Turkey. Nice. Phillips wishing everyone a happy Thanksgiving, of course. The weekend continues on. It's not over yet. I posted a uh, short cat video. It got 1,500 views in about 20 minutes. It just stopped for some reason. I got to figure out the angst on that and find out what's going on. It was really cool. Just put in, you know, put in the title "cutest cat ever" or something like that. A million people went to go look at it, or at least a thousand five hundred. Imperial Valley turkey and ham, nice. I hear bands, and I see lots of people. All right, AK Don LH from Alaska. If I've asked you before, I apologize, but what part of Alaska? I think it was Anchorage. You're calling me a turkey. <laughs> hey, I'll take it. <laughs> I'll take it. Canada doesn't have Thanksgiving. You have something up there similar to that. I, someone was telling me, I don't remember the name of the holiday or whatever it is. I know that, uh, I don't think we've ever settled that war at Niagara Falls either between US and Canada. We gotta work on that. Grandma Slots, cool. From Colorado, what part of Colorado? Put the cat in the crosshairs, or the cat that crossed the street. And you, oh yeah, I could do that. Cat across the street, that'd be fun. I'd probably get a thousand views on that too. Thanksgiving's in October for Canadians. Okay, it's called Thanksgiving. Cool. Pueblo. I spent some time in Pueblo when I was a youth. I wouldn't know that I was there because I was really young, youthy stuff, like from zero to four. Steve, I can remember talking Kino with you, about 10 people now, there's over 2,000. That's right, Philip. It's amazing. Uh, I've been sitting at 22.99, 22.98, 22.97, 22.98, 22.99 since Wednesday. I'll lose one, get one, lose two, get two. Uh, not sure what the deal is there on the subscribers, but it's kind of cool. We'll break 2300 tonight is main street rv park open i don't know i don't know i don't think i've seen it if you're talking about main street station i have not seen their rv park that's a great question i don't know why it wouldn't be downtown grand some gaming i've not been in there for their gaming i gotta try that out kurt's place channel how you doing welcome so had some fun today uh, on the way up here. Had a nice buffalo jackpot. Uh, shouldn't have hit it, but I did. And he got a bunch of re-triggers. And of course, on the re-triggers, no money. 
but overall it was not bad. I think I ended up playing 30, 38 or more games in the bonus round. It took forever, but it did build up a little bit. We do have the hashtag 1001, cool. Elena, how you doing? Hey, is this, is, uh, everyone, I hope you had a great thing too. Oh, cool. Is this, <laughs> what, 2,300? Yep, we were right at 2,300. 1,500 last week in Maryland Live, yep, very cool. Great Dane Mom, suggesting people subscribe, appreciate that very much. Two turkey dinners, I ate tons of leftovers. We also have Asian food with our uh, mixed race family uh, traditional holiday stuff. So uh, all the turkeys and stuff with uh, steamed Calrose rice and other things. Uh, Aces Eights, if you haven't subscribed yet, you better jump in there. <laughs> uh, Thanksgiving was spectacular. The Kurtz Place Channel uh, did a lot of traveling. I was actually going to drive all the way to Austin, Texas, and I was going to surprise everyone by doing that from Vegas. It's only 18 and a half hours driving plus stops. And so by the time I got to Phoenix, I let my wife know what I was thinking about. And she told me I was out of my mind. So uh, I ended up flying with her then. We had to get up at four in the morning and catch flights because everything was booked. And uh, eventually we got there and had a good time. And then flew back this morning. We left Austin, Texas. Uh, we left the place at four. Got to the airport, flew out at six. <clears throat> got into Phoenix about 9, did some Phoenix stuff, and then jumped in the car and got back here just a short time ago before we fired up the, the camera here. I'm hoping the movie production is over and we can park in the lot here, go out and have a couple hours of fun. It looks like they're done. Excellent. Had some guy run out in the middle of the street in front of me today while I was driving. I barely missed him. Just, just running across the red light and on his feet and not sure what he's thinking. Let's see here. Pull in right here in front of, so everyone can look in the car when they buy their ticket. This way I don't have to memorize the license plate. We'll be right here. We have 11 things on a paper plate. Let's do a couple things before I get out to pay for the parking. Let's go over our 11 things on a paper plate. My Slot Journey, how you doing? Here we go. I'm gonna pull this back and let's go over 11 things on a paper plate tonight, what we're looking for. If you're new to the channel, uh, periodically we come up with 11 things on a paper plate to look for, kind of a scavenger hunt, some people uh, called it, uh, kind of like a, our own little version of bingo. Uh, but for Sunday night, our 11 things include a Freedom Rock guy, the Air Guitar guy. That's uh, number one. Number two is make a new friend. Thank you, Intel Wild. Uh, but it can't be Freedom Rock guy. So I have to make a new friend tonight for number two. Some form of friend, some f sort form of uh, doing that. So we have a first time viewer. We have James Young. Welcome. Good to have you here. Uh, if you find that you like what we do, we ask that you please subscribe if you want to and get notifications when we do it again. Uh, number three tonight, you got Tony MTZ. How you doing? Drop the turkey. Good to have you back. Uh, number three tonight is a two-stepper or a two-hand dancing. So it could be like the ballroom dancing. Uh, Silver Kino Gary, how you doing? Good to have you here. And uh, make friends with Bob Ross. If I see him, Panjo, I will. Uh, number four is inappropriate public displays of affection. So PDAs, any kind of inappropriate PDA. Uh, number five, we have to look for doppelgangers of either Michael Jackson, Jared from Subway, Jake from State Farm, or Lily from AT&T. Any of those four doppelgangers will be uh, getting points for number five. Number six is three plus people wearing the same shirt or jacket. Number seven is a card trick or any kind of magic, and it can't be pickpocketing me. Melissa Lee, how you doing? Welcome. Uh, number eight is a face tattoo or face painting, and it can't just be like a little mark like the little teardrop, it has to be like a full-on Mike Tyson type thing. Number nine is a Jessica Rabbit, uh, two points if she's in a costume of any kind. Number 10 is any pet other than a dog. And number 11 is our over-under tonight is one and a half on Journey songs. So will there be two or more Journey songs or just one tonight? Uh, that's for number 11. Then our bonus tonight is, are you, the co are you a cop guy if we see him tonight? So that's our 11 things, we'll go over those again. And I forget who asked me the other day how I come up with the 11 things. And while I was driving today back from Phoenix, I filled out actually two other plates. Got this one, 
and the, oops, sorry, and that one. So there was two other plates that I filled out, and they have just a. There's like 30 different things there that I came up with that we will use this week in our 11 things on a paper plate promotion. Uh, tough list except for the journey music. <laughs> that should be an easy one, exactly. Got 85 folks in here. Thank you so much. Uh, Rob Wall says at least two, so he's over. He's doing the over. So get your guesses in the overs and unders on the uh, the journey songs tonight. Let me grab my mask because I don't want to Omnicron it. Uh, James Young at Fremont, all things are possible. Yes, they are. <laughs> Sometimes, multiple times. Uh, was an on the road buffet, Vicarious Vegas. How you doing? Uh, and got Kino and Kagan's doing the over. Uh, let me show you one other thing. This is the new gimbal. This is the new piece of equipment. It's huge. It's big. It's uh, modern. I believe this is the one that our friends up, up in our way have. And so I was able to pick this up on a Black Friday sale. So I'm going to fire this baby up. If it works, it should work. It better work. And we're going to try to attach the phone to it here in just a moment. I don't know how to use it, but we'll try to make it work. Uh, yes, definitely welcome everybody. The Omba Gimbal. <laughs> uh, here we go. All right, everyone, you have to close your eyes for a minute because it's going to shake you here. I'm going to actually cover it with my hand. There we go. I don't want to do that, actually. Let's see if I can fix that. There we go. If it gets, uh, if it gets a little shaky tonight, let me know. So now... I have to put it into the thing and try not to lose the signal. Now I'm going to turn it on. Okay, close your eyes again. It's going to get real shaky here for a second as I learn how to use it. It's supposed to be moving and to position. And that should be good right there. Bear with me as we try to get this thing to work. It's supposed to be auto stabilized. I'm not sure why. Yeah. So I guess I could have brought the instructions with me. I'll try one more time here. Then we'll get out on Fremont Street. We do have uh, a little bit of time before the music starts up again. If it's your first time on the channel. We like to walk and talk and see people and do things and have a lot of fun. And we're hoping tonight that you enjoyed as much as we do. There we go. We're stabilized. We did it. That's a gimbal in action right there. Okay. I got to turn off the car, make sure I've got the car keys. Who's in charge of that? Got my glasses. Had my glasses. Oh boy. Might be I have to go buy glasses night again. <laughs> yes, definitely please smash that like button. We'd appreciate it very much. All right, we're gonna put the gimbal up here on top of the car. The other one, the battery is wearing out, but I have it now as a backup. So we have two gimbals to work with. All right, one more moment here. Please stand by. Operator error. Here's the parking lot we were in the other day. You can look at the uh, artwork over there. Just gotta grab my glasses out of my jacket. We're on our way. Water and wallet in the front. Yes, definitely. We're gonna get the wallet in the front. I'm gonna wear my heavier jacket even though I don't need it in there. But I believe that's the one that has my glasses in it. I don't wanna have to buy any more glasses. Someone was in charge of reminding me about glasses tonight and I forgot. There they are, got them. Those aren't glasses. If your first time to the channel, this stuff happens. I apologize, don't want to get roofied. <laughs> uh, I don't know. Sorry watching my Lakers barely beat the second worst team in the Eastern Conference. Not a problem, that's a fun thing to do. You gotta be kidding me. So traveling. Steve had turkey stuffing and pumpkin pie. No tacos or donuts. <laughs> oh, so delicious. Tacos and donuts. 
All right, well, we're screwed. LeBron, fine, that's great, all right. Getting our, our paper plate and we're ready to go. Here we go. Fired up early. So here's my glasses case. I brought it, just no glasses. So if I miss your chat tonight, I already apologize in advance, but we are going to go. Enough waiting around. It's time. Here's our beverage tonight. It's lemonade. I'm crocheting a peppermint blanket, red and white. Oh, cool, Duena. Awesome. <laughs> Wouldn't be the stream without chaos. Well, I apologize profusely. Oh my God, I had everything laid out. Of course I did. All right, here we go. Let's just go do it. Let's pay for our parking and let's get on our way. It's Las Vegas, folks. We are in Las Vegas on a Sunday night. This is our where we pay for parking. We put it right here on the front of the car. Swing this around. Look at that stabilization. Oh, 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 oh my goodness. Oh my goodness. Apparently, uh, I hit a bird that's wedged to the front of the car. Oh, oh, I don't like that at all. Uh, let me, let's get the perfect stuff. Oh, my goodness. show you what I'm talking about right here. Don't look. If you don't like seeing dead birds, don't look. But apparently all the way from Phoenix, I brought that with me right there. Poor little creature. Boom. Still stuck to the front of the car. Oh my goodness. I hate when stuff like that happens. Uh, two hours. Next. 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 Okay. We got uh, number 70, how you doing? Welcome. Lucky you didn't get a citation for uh, smacking the, the bird. <laughs> I'm open to donuts now. Would you think sprinkles or jelly filled for you? Uh, me, I actually like the uh, Boston cream filled or lemon filled is really my favorite. Really my favorite. All right, we're all set to go. 107 people in here. We are live in Las Vegas. Just making sure we got the mask on. Got that new uh, stuff going on out there. It uh, apparently gives you a head cold, and we don't want that. We'll walk over here, turn off the lights. Turn it left on. And we're good to go. Chaos is absolutely correct. Oh my goodness. Got a 999 super chat. One second here. back here and figure out what happened there it's john guido that could only happen if you, to you bird kill <laughs> exactly i can't believe it i mean what are the odds that a bird would fly in front of the car while i'm driving just at the speed limit and not exceeding it at any amount whatsoever wow poor bird okay enough of that holy cow you can smell the dope already over here this is Vegas, if you've never been here before. I was flipping the bird on the way to Vegas. I certainly did. Number 70's here, South Paw Crochet with Katie. How you doing? All right, let's get going. It's almost time for the uh, overhead show to start, which is fine, because we'll get all situated. Get my mask on, and we are on the road. We'll go over our list here one more time before we get over on Fremont. So this gimbal is so much more substantial, so much heavier. 
All right, tonight, one more time, our list, 11 things on a Sunday. Number one is Freedom Rock Guy, the air guitar guy. We have to find him. Number two, I'm supposed to make a new friend, courtesy of Intel Wild's suggestion. I like that. But it can't be the Freedom Rock Guy. Uh, I threw that part in. Number three is uh, anyone doing a two-step or two-handed dance. Number four is inappropriate public displays of affection. Number five are doppelgangers, either Michael Jackson, Jake from State Farm, Jared from Subway, or Lily from AT&T. Uh, number six, three plus people wearing the same shirt or jacket. Number seven is card trick or any kind of magic that we see while we're out here. So it has to be like a three card Monty card trick or any kind of magic. Uh, number eight is a face tattoo or paint. It has to be like a full on kind of a thing. Number nine, Jessica Rabbit and two times points if she's wearing a costume. Number 10 is any pet other than a dog. And number 11 is our over under is one and a half on journey songs tonight. Will we hear one or two or more? You gotta get your guesses in now. Bonus if we see the, are you a cop guy? And then uh, one of the things I had on one of the other paper plates we'll use later in the week is when we see something that that's just not right, we'll know what it is because everyone will say, oh, that's just not right. And we'll give like 10 times points if we ever see a that's just not right thing going on. So that's our uh, 11 things on a paper plate for tonight here at Fremont Street. I try to do this without glasses. Oh, oh my God. Let me show you where the glasses were the whole time. Right here. That's where they were the whole time. I put them there so I wouldn't forget them. Oh, dude, just ran the thing. Just broke the, the truck there. Just broke the, gar the gate. Drove right on through. Busy showing you my glasses. I didn't see it. Yeah, 10 times for that's just not right. And it has to be like a unanimous that's just not right. It can't be, oh, look, there's somebody walking a parakeet. That's not right. But we'll know what it is. That's just not right. <laughs> oh, I gotta be careful out here. Wow. Problem is you can run that to go in. It's uh, it's getting out, you gotta pay for it. Blue Oyster Cult versus Journey. Who are they gonna play more? I like that side bet. Gambling in the USA, running through the gate is just not right. Yeah, it's just not right, but I think in the spirit of it's just not right, I don't know if that'd be a 10 times worthy. That'd be a two times. That'd be a two. We'll give, it, we'll give it two times on that one. That was our example. I actually had that guy do that for you just so you could see it. And here's a graffiti wall. I guess everyone gets a chance to fill that out. Very cool. Thank you all very much. Here we are. We're back on the street. If you have a, a channel on YouTube, please drop the link. Let everybody know who you are. Give them a chance to uh, check you out as well. I haven't seen any magic yet. Probably the only guy in a big jacket tonight, but that's all right. Alan here, very good. Thanks for dropping your channel, Kingdom Kangan. 223 earlier at 226 now. That's fantastic. Fantastic, outstanding job. Okay, this is just not right. That's almost just not right. <laughs> Maybe he thought there was a bird on the gate. What do we got going here? We're beating up one of the kids. That wasn't right. You know what? The problem with that's just not right is pretty much everything we see down here are not right. Totem pole. That'll be on a future list. Didn't realize there's totem poles down here. I haven't found a buddy yet. I'm looking for a buddy. Okay. <laughs> I got feathered friends here tonight. This uh, Michael Jackson section will be cut out in the replay, so enjoy it right now. Most of this is not right. This is a dog friend, but not a uh, non-dog cousin.
Alcohol and music don't mix, or do they? Roxanne would be a good one for the list. Yes. What's up, Sugar Flow? This guy's getting the beat right here. The guy in the camo. See what he does with it. He's got a white cup spitting in it. I think there's live mass tonight. We'll find out. We're on this one. There's no Raiders game in town tonight, so it's a little bit different. They uh, they played on Thursday. Featherhead alert. We'll have to do uh, like 20 sets of torn jeans. Okay. Oh my goodness. I'm not going to do that. Oh, they're telling this guy he can't sit. Why can't he sit? Why can't you sit? Tell Tony to TMC, send it over to Glitter Gulch. Is Glitter Gulch still around? They have some bands actually starting later in the night sometimes, so we may not actually have a band right now or just on one of the stages. We'll check it out. That dog was very cute. Yeah. So that's right. That's that is just right. A little awkward tonight. In what regard? Everything. <laughs> there you go. That's awkward. Oh, here's the overhead show. Make friends with a showgirl? Oh, that would be bonus points. Total bonus points for that. J and K staying in Vegas is down on Fremont. Cool. If you let me know where they're at, I'll go say hi and make a new friend. Total points, make friends with showgirl. Oh, so glitter gulch is circa. Okay, cool. Well, it's in the back. Oh yeah, front. I moved it to the back. Now it's in the front again. Thank you. <laughs> this is a new one, I think. More showgirls. Let's see if they want to be my friend. You want to be my friend? You want to be, you want to be my friend? They don't want to be my friend. They gave me the uh, finger emotion like they wanted money to be my friend. There's another name for that. It's not friendship. All four going. Virtual reality. Let's go, Uncle Steve. Into a while. $5 super chat. Thank you. Father Guido. Make friends with a fake showgirl. Triple word show. It's not pickpocketing anybody. Why would you say that? It's a beautiful night so far. Not too many people, but I'm sure it's just getting going. People in the drink line dancing. Red hair. We do have a band. We have at least one band. Looks like we have two bands. We're in for business tonight. Got one right here down at the far end. So both circus. Is this our failed stripper down here? Yes, we just dance, lady. All right, we're going to have some fun tonight. I can already sense it. That'll be my friend for 20 bucks. Five dollars super chat until wild. Yeah, $20 to be a friend long time. Minx, how you doing? Good to have you here. The upside down bike guy, that was gonna be on the list. We didn't put it on the right list. A lot of people bending over tying their shoes tonight. Is there something, is it bend over and tie your shoe night? Be awesome. A bucket drummer to the list, we can get that on the list, definitely. That'd be fun. That never happens down here, that'd be hard to find. The bucket guy, I like the guy with the pots and the pans and the glass. Thanks, welcome. Looks like you know everybody. Good to have you here. Oh, Wonder Woman's getting some action here with uh, the Incredible Hulk.
Oh, see, he's petting her. He just petted her. Grandma <laughs> Slots, how you doing? Oh, there goes the wallet. She got kind of tippy for petting her. Oh, next guy. Gotta get in there. <laughs> she got a 20. She got a handful of 20s there. Good for her. Uh, I don't know that as affection more so as inappropriate touching. <laughs> Gotta do another one. You can't, you can't just do one, you have to do all of them. I've, I've been doing them all for three days. Really? Where are you from? I'm from Alaska. What part of Alaska? Kenai. Kenai for Fairbanks. Fairbanks? Yeah. So, I'm a musician. I play in Fairbanks all the time at the Big Eye and the Boat Terrell. Oh, wow. No yeah. kidding. Fantastic. <laughs> Wow. Well, I know that I've been there. That's right, that's right. Very good. Well, I've been to Kenai. I stayed at the uh, Bingo Hilton, the Bingo Harler. I've never been there. I keep going to yeah. Fairbanks. I'm making new friends. So we're live on YouTube, and I'm supposed to make a new friend tonight is one of my challenges. So I'm Steve Fistbump, Donovan, Donovan Matt, Matt, Missy. Very good. And Phil, how you doing? What's the video for? So this is, uh, let me turn around here. We are live on YouTube. Uh -huh. Got 158 people watching right now. Uh -huh. So we do a thing every night. It's 11 things on a paper plate that we have to accomplish. All right. Well, I'm going to throw out my music so, channel on Facebook for y'all. Yeah, let me know what it is. So, like, huh? here it is. And one is Make a New Friend, number two there. So we just cross that one yeah. off. Yeah. Outstanding. So what's your music channel? I'm Donovan, D-O-N-O-V-A-N, just spelled Do No Band. Lee, L-E-E, music. Donovan Lee, music. Yep. Yeah. Look me up on YouTube. You can find me on YouTube, Facebook, all that. What kind of music? Country, Southern Rock, okay, Texas cool. Red Dirt. Very good. I'm originally from Southeast Texas. Really? I'm a Port Arthur. Oh, wow. Yeah. I, I used to spend the last 10 years in College Station. So, oh, really? Texas. Yeah, so I'm about five hours away. Okay, yeah. Yeah, Port Arthur, hometown of Janice Joplin. Okay, very good. So, How's the chicken down there? Everything's good down there. Oh, that was Mama Cass. All, all the, all the food. Reference. All the food's that good down there. Very good. <laughs> hey, right. Before we leave your broadcast, sure. I gotta tell you, man, you're seriously one of the best friends I've ever had. Uh, I'm gonna miss you, man. We're gonna hug you. There we go. That's an inappropriate touching. I was, I was out there too. So. What are you talking about? <laughs> Take care, buddy. Enjoy Vegas, guys. Thank you. Bye. <laughs> you gotta put your hands on his knees to be considered a new best friend. <laughs> Man, one more drink, that might happen. Holy cow, thank you for another five dollar super chat. There you go, just made new friends. And they're from Alaska and Texas. Wow. Gotta love that. We're knocking stuff off the list. Ten things on a paper plate left to go. Yeah. So from that's not just not right. Unfortunately, it's not on our list tonight. But that's just not right. Uh, kind of a PDA, but uh, I'm thinking more of a longer embrace with uh, awkwardness. Maybe some sort of a moisture exchange, something like that. This is a small world, that's fantastic. There's only like half a million people that ever lived in Alaska, or live in Alaska now, a little bit more than that. So to find an Alaskan is hard. It's almost like a Montana or a Wyoming. And, and, and. Now keep in mind, we gotta find a group of three or more people wearing the same shirt or jacket. We're looking for that. So I'm gonna actually have to leave that portion of the video in. And so this one will not be monetized because we can't cut out that music. But that's cool because this is going to be a fun one. Uh, they're passing the D or probably earlier. Okay. Yeah, if you see J&K staying in Vegas, let me know. The moisture exchange of the Omicron. That's right. I was reading all about it. Not that we're political and uh, politics or a medical station whatsoever. But uh, I'd wait for some more guidance before you panic. That's just my take on it. But let's go over the rules real quick while the music's playing up top. This is a non-controversial channel. We're here to have fun. We're here to goof off, to uh, watch people making a fool of themselves. And if they dress up in a costume or put on face paint or whatever, totally open to uh, whatever kind of laughter is involved. But we don't make fun of people because of their race, religion, country of origin, size, shape, color, gender preferences, or any other things like that. You have the right to be who you are on this channel. Nobody judges for that reason, but if you want to, you know, come out here and dress up like a cop here with whips and stuff, what the heck, let's have some fun. 
So uh, we have so many moderators on here for a reason. Also, a lot of people say you have a lot of wrenches on your channel. Are you a famous YouTube blogger? I kind of am. I don't know. It's 100. Let me do this here. Who are you? You didn't say yes. So I didn't say yes. No. But it's party time. So <laughs> we have 160 people want to know your name. What's your name? No, I know. Okay. I just got. There was kind of a public display of affection there. But. Holy cow. You can put your makeup back on. Oh, oh my goodness. How many people know the Greek alphabet? I had to learn it in fifth grade. I can't show them. I don't want to show them. Everyone do your pop pop pause at home. So I'm not sure if I know these guys. This might be Velvet Elvis tonight. There was a second Wonder Woman. Where? You need to find the second Wonder Woman. That was another friend, yeah. You have a wrench, you brought your own wrench? <laughs> I like you bringing your own wrench. That's pretty cool. Uh, I just accidentally deleted someone's message. Liz Peak, I'm sorry, let me, uh, uh, I don't know how to undo that. I don't know how to undo that. I just hit it by mistake. I apologize, I trying to do something else there. So, Lewis, if I hit you by mistake there, I apologize. Okay, we got Blue String Theory down at the end with the 80s music. And they're in front of Circa. Where are they at? What do they look like? Let me know. I'm right here in front of Circa. Thanks for the live stream, brother. I appreciate it. How are you doing? Right from Minnesota. Right from Minnesota. Is this okay to put you on? Yeah, yeah. All right, we made our third friend tonight. Rick from Minnesota is a subscriber. Yeah. What, what brings you here? Uh, haven't been here in 23 years. I went to culinary school here. Oh, cool. Wanted to see how it changed. It changed a lot. It changed a lot, definitely. Yeah. I'll certainly be coming to your hotel. I'm looking forward to oh, that. Good. Excellent. Hey, nice to meet you. Nice to meet you. Thank you. All right. Three tonight. Woo! Party to you. Red sweater and a purple hair. That's gonna be easy enough to find. Red sweater and purple hair. Look at. Friends, you want to be my friend? Oh, that was inappropriate. Sorry. All right, red sweater, purple hair. Where are you? I'm almost going to hit by our whip there. That's on one of the lists later this week. Dave K, staying in Vegas. Where are you? Wonder Woman! This is where you get yourself measured. The guy brings a measuring tape, and you guess how big you are, and then he measures you. Height, tall, tallness. Height, that's what he's measuring. All right, where we at? Purple hair, looking for purple hair. Martin D, how you doing? Welcome. There's Donovan Music. In front of the ABC store. That's right back here. Going back, there's the ABC store. Okay, there they are right there. I see them. Right here, these folks. J and K. J and K, how you doing? I'm Steve with uh, Cash or Crash Las Vegas Live, and everybody's telling me you guys were out here. Yeah. yeah. So I want to say hi. How you doing? Good. Good. Uh, your name? Christina. Christina. Fist bump. Yeah. We'll do a fist bump. We're not doing handshakes. And and your name? Jeff. Jeff. How you doing? Good. So, uh, are you from Vegas? Yeah. Okay. Cool. Yeah. Very good. Good. Yeah. So I do this. Uh, I, I'm actually opening a new hotel in town. But for fun, for, for fun, I do this. So, yeah, good. Can turn this around. They, they told me I had to come find you. Guys. There you go. What's up, everybody? So, if they want to subscribe to your channel, what do they look for? Uh, right here. Jane K. State Vegas. Outstanding. Yeah. 
Very good. So go over to their channel, tell them you said hi, and uh, appreciate it. Nice to meet you. All right, very nice to meet you. Enjoy. Nice to meet you. It's a uh, big friend night. All right. I, I can tell by the purple hair. I thought it was red sweater and purple hair at the same time. But. Jeff and Christina, all right. Yes, yeah, sw swoop on over to their channel, tell them hi. From Casper Craft. Jeff Leppard. Arizona Cowgirl, how you doing? West Coast Tunes, maybe later. We'll do this for a little bit. Back-to-back Def Leppard, that should be on our list. Sugar plum. Yep. Yeah. <laughs> I just got whipped three times. It's a bonus. It's a new uh, gimbal. That's what it is. It's bigger and more pronounced. We're gonna make the new 11 plate challenge over. So a new one should be going to the green door later. <laughs> Thank you for the five dollar super chat. Into a while. I'd go, but I don't have a squeegee. Benatar. Oh, public display of affection. Almost. Just feeling it. Do you feel me? That's what she said. James from Florida! Yeah, I'll do the list again for you. Here we go. Someone's sleeping on the floor. Right. Let's do the list. <laughs> Get your pencil and paper ready. Tonight we have Freedom Rock Guy, he's here. I have to make a new friend, number two, we've done that already. Number three is two-step or two-hand dancing. It could be a ballroom dance or two-step two or hands on the booty, whatever it is. Number four is the inappropriate PDAs. I haven't really seen the inappropriate stuff yet, but we've seen some PDAs. Number five is doppelgangers. Michael Jackson. Jake from State Farm, Lily from at and or Jared from Subway. If you see any of their doppelgangers, we got points for that. Uh, not Jay and Silent Bob. Uh, three plus people wearing the same shirt or jacket. That's another one. No entry. What's that? We don't get no entry. 
Oh, you have to go down that way and around. Good luck. All right. <laughs> I'm giving directions to the circuit now. Uh, number seven, a card trick or any kind of magic. Number eight is a face tattoo or painting on the face. Number nine, Jessica Rabbit. Double points if she's in a costume. Number 10, any pet other than a dog. And number 11 is our over under on journey songs tonight. One and a half, you're either over or under. And of course, the are you a cop guy is a bonus tonight if we see him. Those are the things that right there. Oh, there we go. Schoolgirl. That was on the list. Or is that somewhere from Scotland? I don't know. <laughs> Martin. <laughs> it's so grounding. Oh, it's going to be fun tonight. I can already tell. Exact reason why I don't drink alcohol. Oh, wait a mural, checking in. How you doing? Hey, G. Jordan, we don't know. We're not going to judge. We're just going to enjoy. The Chris Place Channel, stay safe. We will. We'll see you next time. Oh, we got slamming going on. Boy, Neil Macedo from Intel Law, five dollars super chat. Thank you, sir. Neil, what's up? JKC, very close to Jared. Ha ha. Martin B, have a good night. Thanks for checking in. This might be a two step. Pretty good dance move right there. We have a spinner. More spinning. Doris, how you doing? Doing great. Is that a uh, inappropriate uh, <laughs> superstar? It's Molly Shannon. Nailed it. Doppelganger. Hotel will open sometime first part of 2022, February targeted. A little better idea later this week when our stuff starts coming in off the ocean. What's up with spinning? I didn't know that was a thing. Alan, you know it. The fact, it's Tootie. <laughs> nice. Uh, no gambling at the hotel. We're a non-gaming hotel. We got all the food and beverage you could ever want. Spinner was actually on one of the plates I wrote earlier. We didn't use it tonight. Should have. Would have nailed it. <laughs> oh no, it's the cars. Gotta run, gotta run. It's the cars. Gotta get down here. Cars is one of those groups that if you play their music, you get in trouble right away, so we gotta get away before they start singing and anyone knows what it is. Let's get down here to Blue String Theory as fast as we can. Running from the cars.
Natalie from Facts of Life. That's right, not Tootie. I guess I should have watched Facts of Life more. Here's our uh, failed stripper. She's back. See something really inappropriate going on there in a minute. Another Billy Idol. Go to Marriott.com, type in Las Vegas. January, February, March, sometime like that. We're the first one that comes up. Tell you all about Todd English, the English Hotel.
on YouTube. People being rescued. Backwards back man on the fleet. We don't have that yet, but we should. Not sure what this red and black shirt is here, but she's having fun. Yeah. 
just by himself. Thank you, David. 
have to do the uh, pledge, the mod pledge. Uh, someone want to tell us the mod, uh, mod pledges? You pledge to be good, fun, enjoy, support, and uh, carry out all the wishes and commands that might be crazy and not quite illegal. There you go. Ted Nugent was here. Oh, our first journey song, yeah! Thank you, Southwalk Crochet with Katie. for the Bronx. How you doing? Good to have you here. We love trolls. Trolls are our friend. The good trolls. No box. Oh, the stockings came down. Got my friends over here laughing, having a good time. Uh-oh, uh-oh, uh-oh. Got some inappropriate touching. Hand on the butt, hand on the butt. Would you say that's just not right? <laughs> we can't say that, okay. That's, not right. That's just not right. Alright. <laughs> the hands on the butt part. That's Vegas, baby. You got it. You got it. Definitely. <laughs> Making more friends tonight. Stockings are down. Grandma's long. We got this guy now with the sport jacket on. <laughs> yeah, it stays on Fremont and on most uh, bloggers' web pages. That's not right. Ten times twice. <laughs> oh my god. Y'all from Vegas? No. Where are you from? Fresno. Okay, cool. That's why I gave up drinking. <laughs> Walk us 
the pilot. Everyone's uh, having a good time tonight. Appreciate you being here. You check out the room rates tonight. Seven hundred dollars, six hundred dollars in Vegas. Not a whole lot of low budget people here right now. Grand Canyon University. <laughs> Something's up. All right, my man. This ball. Not gonna burn my hand. I don't want to ask what happened to his shirt. Whatever it is, it's the town speed. Alex? <laughs> hey Ryan! He is having a good time. That's right by fruit. <laughs> <laughs> Go ahead, kick the cup, kick the cup. <laughs> a one man party on his shirt. <laughs> it's a drunk runner, T23. No! Oh, 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 David was a hundredth like, all right. That's cool. It's all good. Little uh, Bon Jovi, I guess. Here we go. the words. He's yelling at somebody. That could be a magic trick.
Football game, Kyle. He doesn't know the words of this one either. He's spitting mad. Yep, there's, there's a lot of free smoke here, if that's what you're asking. Not sure why anyone would ever pay for anything here. from back to the future? He's singing 
speaking in a foreign language. for a few minutes, then we'll come back. This is where the part of Leno's wasted. <laughs> Leno's having a good time. Look at these shirts. The best shirt. Those are the best shirts in Vegas, by far. <laughs> What's that? It's actually it's on YouTube. Oh. Hey! Hey, I'm famous! Mom! You said I'd never make it! Fuck you, Dad! I'm big in Vegas, baby! <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> oh. Not the same shirts, unfortunately. Similar shirts, but not the same ones. Oh man, oh man, oh man. <laughs> <laughs> oh, I'm gonna walk in here for a minute. <laughs> yeah, baby. Good stuff. Here's our wheel of fortune again. Oh, Dad is still disappointed. <laughs> Dad's shaking his head right now, like, oh my god. All right, oh, someone just hit. The uh, Wheel of Fortune just starts over 200,000 each time. So it'll probably get hit again right away. You get up to about two, yeah, I know, I gotta edit that. You get up to about 250,000, it'll hit again. And then it'll grow up to about six or 700,000. But that, when every time you see a 200,000 like that, it's just reset. Someone's hit the uh, three symbols somewhere in the Wheel of Fortune world. Let's go over here. We're gonna play this old one right here. The three tenors. Uh, let's do this one here. We're not gonna win, but we wanna spin. We won't hit the big one, but we'll do this one. Appreciate y'all being here. This is so much fun tonight. Phil, Frank, going to sleep? Have a good night, Phil. Thanks for being here. So far, we've never hit anything on these. No money there? Well, they're having a great time. Got a contact buzz from their breath. There we go, money. Four coins. Just want one spin. Let's get a spin here. Oh, winner, winner. Got to pull the arm request. Here we go. Do it again. Almost a winner. <laughs> it's a wild five dollar super chat. Dad is very disappointed. Smoosh. Exactly. Our poor father. And another four coins. Winner. Three more with the handle. At least we got some action here. Come on, wheel. Remont is fantastic. Oh. I thought he had the spin over there. Come on now, let's hit something. Ooh, look at that. Big money, 20 coins. We want to spin. 
One spin. One spin for everyone. <laughs> yeah, which one of you is his dad? Davy T Bones 69, have a good night. Thank you. Come on, spin. Hashtag spin. Let's get a hashtag spin in there. We're gonna spin. Almost right there. Oh, come on, spin. Hashtag spin. Double nothing. So close. Oh, double that would have been sweet. No many big whammies? Or the other way around. One spin. It's like our fourth time playing these. We have not got a spin yet. Double nothing. Oh, so close. We're gonna get it though. Here we got uh, eight more shots. Nothing yet. It's amazing, DJ Starman 69 slots. Not a thing. Come on. Wheel. Not a thing. Oh my goodness. Double. Nothing. Holy cow. And you don't get the spin on too. That was brutal. Brutal. Holy cow. Holy cow, that was not fun at all. What's this one here? What do we got here? I'm gonna put a dollar in and see what happens. Do a uh, Papa Giorgio here. 25 lines. I'll put another dollar in. You gotta do a dollar 25 minimum. Go big dollar here, one play. And we'll have 75 cents left over. We'll go play a wheel one more time. Here we go. Give me something. Oh, we got some money back. What do we got? We got nothing. I will leave that money for someone else. I don't carry cash with me usually on a night like tonight just because I don't want to get robbed. There's a real good chance I will. There four days ago, left early, nothing was hitting. Better luck for you. Okay. Thank you very much. Take the Buffalo for the ride. I uh, actually hit Buffalo at the uh, railroad pass on the way in this evening. I got that video coming out this week. Pretty excited about it. Had all kinds of like 38 bonus spins. Uh, not all of them hit anything, but the ones that did made a little bit of money on it. Then I went ahead and pissed it away on some other stuff. That's how you do it here. This song will be over here shortly. Fortunately, they charge like 10 bucks ATM fees down here, so I'm not going to hit the ATM. Yeah, uh, look forward, because I'll have the, uh, the, the thumbnail will be the buffalo with all the coins. And then, of course, uh, I'll highlight the buffalo on the uh, header so you know which one it is. Because anytime I can actually hit the buffalo, I like it. I thought they could do Sweet Carolina again, but I'm glad they did. That looks refreshing. Is that Gary Busey? Gary Busey in the green plaid? Maybe not. Yeah, this song I'll be cut out. Every time we do I'm going to walk over here for just a minute. We'll get out of the music. That guy over here arguing with himself. Just join us. We're live on Fremont Street tonight, having fun, watching people enjoy the music, the bands, the live uh, entertainment, people watching, and of course, uh, the Carimo is off in the distance. Do a hashtag, let me know where you're watching from if you're just joining us. First time ever, we do this quite a bit. Uh, if you've been here a lot, you know what we do here. Also, the English Hotel. Be sure to check it out at Marriott.com. Uh, that's why I'm in town. We're opening a new hotel. It's in the Arts District. Uh, celebrity Chef Todd English, his new hotel with his new restaurant, the Pepper Club. Like old guy there. Uh, but check that out at Marriott.com. Type in Las Vegas. It's the first one that pops up, the English Hotel. And uh, we'll be open sometime in February, I believe, is the current target date on that. So stay tuned for more information. 
And keep in mind, every one of you, uh, when you're here on this channel, you get a special discount code for the English Hotel from Cash or Crash. That's coming soon, we get closer to open. Uh, but right now, if you want to stay here in like June or May or whatever, we can actually book rooms. Uh, it's live right now on Marriott.com, so check that out. Uh, we are having fun down here on Fremont Street, trying to stay safe. This is the uh, Omicron variant uh, mask that I'm wearing tonight, because who wants that stuff? I don't. I don't know what it is. I'm sure it's uh, perfectly uh, up to the people in charge to tell us what to do and what not to do. And so we don't violate any rules here on YouTube. We're very excited to not speak about all that stuff. But I uh, just want to let you know I'm being safe tonight. So we're going to go out here now. And the music should be starting up any moment. <laughs> Using the new gimbal tonight. Picked it up over in Austin, Texas. The band is back. Let's see what's going on on this stage and that stage. We'll go down to the uh, DJ stage tonight here in a bit as well. I think some of our friends have left. Much it cleared out here. As soon as the music starts, it should fill up again. Should. There's public displays of affection over there. Okay, let's see what's going on this line. So now Spandex Nation is replaced Blue String Theory. We'll go down to Spandex Nation for a minute. AG Jordan III, have a good evening. Thanks for checking us out. Thank you. 
just a good time. Nothing but a good time. It's Robert Graham. Brooker, of course, the America's foremost female ventriloquist, appearing on all kinds of TV shows, recently on Judge Jerry, has a great video out. She does a towel jugging, juggling thing. TV in the house, all right. That guy likes this stuff. There we go. Totally picked it for hip hop guys. Yeah. 
Marshall.
all the same t-shirts. We got a winner. Mark it down on your list. More than three of the same t-shirts. The Unicorn Drinking Team. Very nice. That's on our list. More than three of the same t-shirts. Head down to the DJ booth down here at the DJ stage, see what they got going on. They usually got some good music going on and some unique dancers down here as well. I knew we'd get another one checked off our list. Father Guido! We got Michael Jackson, one of our doppelgangers right here. We got another one. Are we down to five things? We got two more. We got the Michael Jackson doppelganger. We got the Correct. Get back here. We got the jacket going on. Hey, Father Guido, John says hi. Hey, Father. John Guido says hi. Father Guido, over here. Nice man. <laughs> line dancing, we got line dancing. Oh, it's gonna hit by some feathers. That's a saw with a fuzzy feather. That's... John Guido says hi. John Guido. Okay. You seem to acknowledge it, John. <laughs> Outstanding. <laughs> Looks like Al Pacino, too. Got some pink feathers over here. Can we go? Can we go? We can go. We're gonna, oh, we're not going to go. Got to hit by a car right here. Crossing against the green. Don't go. There's people here too. He's my dad. He better. John Guido, 499 Super Chat. <laughs> That's your dad. We found him. We take down the posters now out at the post office. Get them off the milk cartons. We found him. West Coast Tunes, we're doing live here tonight on Fremont. Got a bunch of gambling videos all over the place. Got more coming out. We're down to our last minute before our time runs out on our parking anyway. Time to hit the strip. Always careful. 20 minute parking check, thank you, Rob Wall. Very 
vehicle. Big drink alert, big drink alert, big drink alert. Loverboy cover song. More Michael Jackson music. More feathered people. Cover song. DJ Starman is a nice lot still here. Almost had a cup in there. Rock steady. Three bands going on. Today was an awesome day. Started out in Texas. Flew to Arizona and drove to Nevada. Another slow day.
move down towards the uh, vehicle in the parking lot. We're going to jump in the car. Just do a quick run if everybody wants to hang out for that, or we can uh, do it tomorrow. It's up to you. If you want to do a script drive, do a hat. This is where we parked over here somewhere. Appreciate y'all being here. We're gonna head over to the car now and uh, see if we can't get out. We'll drive up and down the strip a little bit if you want to hang out for some more. I know a lot of you have to work in the morning. I know I do. Uh, this is what it is. It's Vegas. It's a great holiday weekend. For whatever reason, the place is packed in Vegas right now. I looked at some hotel room rates earlier tonight. And uh, $600, $500 for places that don't normally get that kind of a rate. So there must be a huge demand going on here. Huge convention, some sort. Something going on or just party people in the house. Whatever it might be. But Vegas is busy. Very busy. Let's see here. Amazon is in town. Oh, that's right. That is correct. You are right. Thank you very much. Oh, look here. We started our stream with them breaking this. Now they're trying to fix it. Beginning of our stream, we saw the guy drive through that and break it. Here they are fixing it. The frozen concoction that helps me hang out. <laughs> it's the D Hotel Casino. Was that my first time meeting Enrique and Melissa? Yes. That was fun. That was great. Good people. That's up, up in our way, I believe. Correct? And I met a bunch of other people tonight. Made a lot of new friends tonight. I'll have to go back and review the video, see who they were and what they're doing here. Our J and K stay in Vegas. Got to meet them. Got the uh, Hawaiian shirt guys. They were fun. for our light here we'll go jump in the car we'll head up and down the street give me a chance to plug the phone in i started getting uh, power warnings a little bit ago don't want it to die like it does so many 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 times we do this thing i walk the red i'm a rebel that's why i do it a lot of new friends tonight a lot of new friends tonight it's amazing i never really tried that before but uh I guess when you're on Fremont Street, and it is a holiday weekend, got all the other stuff going on, introduce some uh, beverage, courage, it's a lot of fun. Now that that's how it looks like over here, dead on the streets, yeah, exactly. Kick the bird off the car, let's see if it's still on the car. What if it was just hanging on? What if it was like a spider dressed like a bird? We saw a few of those tonight. Lots of spiders dressed like birds. All right, let's see what we can do here. For those of you just joining us, oh, he's still there. Peel the bird off the grill. All right, we're gonna use our paper plate. Number 13 is peel the bird off the grill. Oh, go, oh. Come on, go away. Come on, go, oh. Oh, 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 come on. Oh, that's just nasty. I gotta throw this paper plate away now. Oh, his head's stuck in there. Ah, oh. all right, we're gonna leave it there for a bit. I don't know what to do. Oh, there's feathers. Ah, oh. sorry you had to see that. I gotta mark it disturbing. Use a cone, use the cone. Oh, I like that. Okay, hold on here. Good idea, John. Use a cone here. Get this set up. It worked. Yeah, there's still parts of it stuck there, but uh, maybe the Wolverines will gnaw it away. Holy cow. <laughs> what a rough day. Appreciate y'all being here. Let's get inside the vehicle for safety. Watch out for the bird, please. <laughs> the male potential right there. Oh, man. 
<laughs> What's the guy doing with the safety cone on the front of his car? Uh, let's get in here before something else happens. Uh, thank you. It's a rental car. One month ago, somebody backed into me and did some damage to my bumper on my other vehicle. And they've not been able to fix it since. Oh, wow. This thing has a light on it. Oh, there we go. Sorry about that. It's going to get bumpy for a second. I forgot to warn you. Give me one second here. We're going to put it in the other holder. Get it back in the car holder here. Another brief second of bounciness, if that's a word. Get this thing pop properly. There we go. There we go. We're back. Okay. Let me know if you can still see it, if there's still a screen, if there's still imagery coming your way. Uh, for a moment there, it disappeared from my end, but I think we're good. And we're about ready to get going here. It's all good. Hopefully it's all good. Find all my stuff and we're on our way. Let's go do the strip. You're live in Las Vegas on a Sunday night. Let's go see if the strip's even busy. The feed is good, excellent. I'm gonna back up a little bit here so you can see the bird. Yeah, he's down there by the end of the parking cement thing there. Poor fella. Did anyone catch his name? Because maybe we should say something. There he is right there. Bye, bird. I wonder where I got him. What part of Arizona or Nevada? And then I just drove over a curb. Delana, good night. You be safe as well. Thanks for being here. Appreciate all y'all being a part of this. Now it's the uh, cool down period. Like after you run a marathon, you have to run a little bit. So we're gonna do some cool down here. Please avoid the resorts world. We will definitely do that. RIP bird, you got it. <laughs> Straight cats are taken care of. You got that right, John Guido. <laughs> hey, your father can dance by the way, just so you know. The bird is the word. <laughs> very, uh, very family guy there. Welcome to uh, part three of our live event here tonight. It's not as late as it feels. I'm sure it is, but I'm still jacked up. Got up bright and early this morning, four o'clock. I uh, got a ride to the airport in Austin, Texas. Waited in the airport for a little bit, had a bagel. That was fun. Got on the plane, flew all the way into Phoenix, got the car, went to the place, did the stuff, brief nap, got up, a little shopping, headed out to Vegas, got here just before we started the live, and here we are. Thanks for the ear room. <laughs> uh... Natasha Brown, the bird is the word. Uh, it's your first time with us. This is kind of what we do. There's really no rhyme or reason to it. It's fun. It's showing you Vegas from different perspectives and different angles. Sometimes we're on the streets, uh, not, not always on the main streets. We'll take back roads. We'll take different neighborhoods. Uh, we'll do some different things to try to bring you Vegas from a different perspective of other uh, the Vegas YouTubers. And there's so many of them here doing their thing. It's fantastic. They're all uh, bringing it to you live here or in recorded fashion, and that's what we're doing as well. And I uh, appreciate your suggestions and comments and ideas. We try to find fun things to do. Driving by the gold and silver pawn shop there, Pawn Star fans. Little, little warm down, I think they call it in the, in the running world. This is our warm down. Gate, the Gateway Motel, the Gateway Drug Motel, the Gateway Motel. I can't read it. Oh, it's the Gateway Motel. There's no drug on there. 
Derek P., having a great Thanksgiving. Hopefully you are as well. We just had a uh, Thanksgiving party on Fremont Street. Outstanding time. Some great super chats tonight. Thank you, everybody, for your support of the channel. Really appreciate it. It's our best month ever. And it's because y'all got some police action over here, or did they just shut off their lights? We missed the fun stuff. Cops doing a U-turn. Who's coming back? The uh, person is trying to use the air pump there for some reason. Dad is driving, leave the windows up. <laughs> uh, DJ Star, how you do? Are you out of here? All right, cool, man. Get some, get some rest, get some sleep. Got Manny Test is here. Hello. San Antonio, Texas. Love San Antonio. Used to live in Hilotas area. The Talk of the Town magazine store. Not sure. Uh, I didn't realize people are selling magazines still. Got a few pedestrians out here, but most of the stuff's been torn down. That was really bad out here. They left some of the landmark properties. So they redo this entire part of Las Vegas. Appreciate the mods. Thank you so much for being a part of uh, the success of the channel and helping to bring the uh, clean, fun, non-offensive, non-political, non-religious, non-controversial topics to you every night. We may brush up against something just as a uh, fun item on our paper plate, but we're not going to discuss the pros and cons of any legislation, any policies, any thought processes, any vaccines or non-vaccines, none of that. Uh, is appropriate for this channel. There's so many other great channels you can go to on that. Uh, we just want to enjoy what we see and do. And uh, I'm really feeling like a jack-in-the-box drive through tonight. He's got a hankering for jack-in-the-box tacos. back what's the driving adventure uh really no no plan just gonna drive the strip real quick and then i gotta grab some food then i gotta get some sleep because i gotta work in the morning i actually got that job that i'm here for this is my fun stuff this is my hobby mom food plant and things is here cool I'm feeling jack-in-the-box. I don't know why. There's just something about a jack-in-the-box taco. Usually means it's the end of your night or you're just going to be locked up. One of the two. The last time I was on was when you ended the stream that night. Okay, cool. Can we have nuggets, Dad? I'll get one big nuggets and y'all got to share. But only one dipping sauce. I don't want to hear about it. So you guys decide on what dipping sauce you want. Can't afford two. Aaron Casino. Not tonight. Yes, I live here in Vegas. I also, we have a place in Scottsdale, and, and then I live here in Vegas for the job to open up the new English Hotel. The English Hotel will be opening sometime in February. Ranch is the... Oh, it's a ranch. Dipping Nuggets and Ranch. Okay. No one else says anything. Ranch it is. The Aztec Casino. Down the street there. If you have Kevlar underwear, it's a good neighborhood. Oh, Derek, that's right. Oh, man, Derek. The the chat went south really fast. I wasn't really paying attention because I was gaming, having fun. And so I ended it and almost immediately hit a five out of five for $850 on uh, Kino. And then I went and hit a bunch more jackpots. I hit a dancing drums for over $300 at Treasure Island. And so all of that I actually put out for members only just as a uh, release video for them. But that was all because uh, it just got knuck knuckleheaded in there. And so we just shut down the uh, stream and I just kept going and it was a great night afterwards. I really wish we could have kept the, the chat going. But hey, it is what it is. It was time. And that was uh, the last one we did before this one. A few days off for the holidays and we are back. Yeah, that was uncalled for. But it, again, everyone just started getting all worked up over whatever. And that's why we say nothing. We don't want to do any of that stuff here. Everyone is right in their own mind. Everyone is right in their own beliefs. And no matter what you do, you can sit and talk to someone until you're blue in the face. 
if even if you try to convince them to change their opinion, then what? Let's say uh, they do change their opinion, then what? Where do you go from there? It's the argument that everyone enjoys. They enjoy arguing over stuff, so we just don't want that here because it gets all cluttered. The other Steve, how you doing? Steve D, it was great meeting you the other day. For those of you who didn't hear, uh, Steve D popped into the English Hotel, where you're all welcome to do that. Come on down, I'll give you a tour. Just let you see what it's all about. That was very cool. I think Steve D was on five channels that night before and then uh, came down to the hotel. Oh, it was a great night after the uh, stream went off. Oh. But hey, you know, I did play some Sun and Moon and gave a lot of it back. And tonight, uh, the two videos or three videos I got from tonight, uh, I did hit a Buffalo. I did hit some Kino stuff. And then at the end, I thought I'd just, you know, make a fortune on lightning links and of course didn't but a guy who was sitting across from me was playing four card kino had six numbers six numbers six numbers and six numbers on his four cards along the top row and all 10 numbers hit and he ended up with 2700 in uh, nickel play at the uh, railroad pass casino it was really cool to see how many vloggers have i met that's a great question i know if, i'm going to just throw a number out there uh, probably nine to twelve right now of Vegas people or people that have come to Vegas. Uh, that doesn't count the Kino vloggers who I've met as well uh, in and out of Vegas. You could probably add another 15 onto there. So close to third. It's pretty cool. It's a neat little uh, group of people that uh, do this. It's, uh, it's a lot of fun and uh, very cool to have people come over. Uh, pretty soon, uh, Las Vegas Inside and Out with uh, Dale and Paula, they're going to come in for a tour. Uh, not leaving Las Vegas, we'll give him a tour. I already promised him uh, up close and personal of the hotel when I first got to town. Reached out to them and uh, a bunch of other people that want to do it. And of course, anyone that would like to just send me an email or get a hold of me and we will set up a uh, personalized tour of the English Hotel through the uh, marketing agency. Todd English has a sophisticated, slick marketing agency. He's, had, he's been doing this uh, celebrity chefing for 40 some years, I think. All kinds of merchandise and TV appearances and his own TV shows and cooking shows and all that. And they've got a great apparatus set up for that. We love uh, introducing you and showing it off to you. All right, we're going to cut up here by the Resorts World. We think we'll make it out safely. I did play the coin-operated machines that night. They had the uh, dollar uh, token or the dollar machines. I did play it and I hit a little bit of a jackpot. And I actually cashed it out and had to take all the coins to the cage and cash them in. I think that's on one of the videos. I hit a double, triple cherry, or cherry, double, cherry, whatever it was. Uh, but it uh, started kicking out the coins. It was so cool. You put your $20 bill in, it kicks out 20 coins. It was an old Vegas feel. Plus, I got my hands dirty, and I was able to, you know, touch my eye and got an infection from it. So it's totally Vegas. Here's the uh, Bagel Mania, where the pink box donuts is located. Still got to make a plan to get down here for that. Very quiet out here now on a Sunday night. Look at this. But there's no lines at the taco places. Pepper Mill's probably busy. Can't believe all those people are shopping at Ross Dress for Less at this hour. It's my Walgreens. I've been going there since 2010. Dave the pharmacist. There's somebody running in front of us. Awesome. Uh, we're going to touch Resorts World here briefly, but we got the green, so let's get out of here before we lose our stream. That's kind of eerie, definitely. Uh, when it's super busy, that's fun. My favorite hotel other than the English Hotel. Uh, when I come here just to stay and play, I will stay at probably three or four different hotels. I love Palace Station. I love the Gold Coast, and I love the Orleans. And then I also do Sam's Town or I'll do uh, Sunset Station or some of those others. Uh, I do not stay on the Strip. I just avoid it. I have no interest in it whatsoever. I've uh, been here, done that. Anytime people come to town, this is where we have to go. Uh, but as far as staying in the hotels here, I've been at the Bellagio. I've been at different places like that. And it's a lot of fun. It's just so big that uh, I'm tired of walking by the time I get from the parking lot to the room or from the room back down to the casino house. I'd rather put that walking into having the camera live and walking up and down the strip. 
looking for feathered friends. The station's very good. Uh, hotels, they do a great job. Cater to locals. And of course, Boyd Gaming. So did I keep filming after the end of the stream? Yes. Uh, Derek, I'm gonna release those to everyone here shortly. I, I always do stuff like that for members of the channel first. So there's a benefit to having membership here. And I appreciate their uh, support of the channel. So I do that, but then I'll get those released out for everyone. It was a lot of fun. In Vegas in February 19, it snowed that week. Wow. Wow. I don't know that I've seen snow here. I've seen ice here. We had uh, wind and freezing temperatures, and we had a water leak on the roof of our hotel, the Clarion, and it blew the water off the side, and it froze on our front driveway. We had to put up all kinds of barricades and things to keep it so people wouldn't crash or slip and fall. Appreciate your support, and I appreciate the comments. It's so very fun to do this. There's the volcano. It's not going on right now. It's really dark here. Look at this. Guess everyone's done for the night. Although in five minutes, maybe there is a volcano show. People are starting to line up. Siegfried and Roy Way, right here at the mall. M-A-L-L, -L, not M-A-W-L. It's gotta suck to get pulled over on the strip. Snow's in January. Uh, I've seen in the mountains here a lot of snow. They actually had snow a month ago up in the mountains here. Got a cold front came through. It's beautiful. It's like in Phoenix or uh, Tucson if they ever get snow. Tucson, a little higher elevation, more likely. Especially with Mount Lemon up there. There's a ski resort in Tucson. You guys are troopers still hanging out here. Caesar's Palace to the right, the link to the left, and the Flamingo, of course. Got tons of hand sanitizer tonight. Been uh, rubbing it all over my hands and my exposed skin on my face. You don't want to get that too near your eyes, though. Snow on Mount Charleston in the summertime. Yes, they'll get the snow up there. Melts pretty quick. On Wednesday, it was so windy that the first volcano eruption happened. Then they made the announcement came on that the show were stopped due to the inclement weather. It's too inclement for a volcano. Del Taco on Tuesday. Yeah, we'll probably do Tuesday tacos again. That was actually a lot of fun. We'll try to get it at a time when they're not super busy so they can actually make the tacos with food in them and uh, maybe put them in the bags for us the way we want. We'll do six to a bag. I think that's fun. Small groups of people everywhere. That's just something that happens. There's a whole area up in Rancho area that I want to go to, probably. We should go up there and do it. There's so many people there. Terrible insomnia. Oh, from Agent Orange Syndrome? Wow. Uh, Vietnam area? Amazing. Sorry to hear that. Here's the Bellagio, and no fountain show going on right now. Fulin says, I'm going to steal your idea. Oh, cool. Yeah. Six bags of tacos. Or it's a lot of fun. It's easy. It's uh, a rancho is a rancho road where you head up towards the Texas station and the Rancho Fiesta up there at the freeway. And right as you get off there, there's like a, an outlet, not an outlet mall, like a maybe a craft mall or something up there. I think it's called the Rancho Mall or whatever it is. But uh, there's a whole community homeless that gather there every night. Uh, they have to wait till a certain time of night when uh, all the people are not there anymore. And then they actually set up tents in like a whole community there. It's close to a uh, church that does uh, food giveaways. I'm sure that's part of it. But it's also bright enough for safety. And uh, it's just one of those communities that have uh, evolved over time due to the hardships that people have had to deal with. And so if we can go there and just uh, do something. I feel I feel helpless at times, but you got to do something. You can't talk about doing it. You just got to do it, whatever it might be. It's like holding the door for someone and being nice to them. It just changes people's perspective on life. 
You never know how bad a day they're having. Uh, you know, the person that we saw dancing tonight, whether it's the, uh, you know, the Jay Leno guy or someone else, uh, who knows what got them to this point in their life. That that's what they wanted to do. And hopefully the joy that they have is something that, you know, people contemplate a lot of things and you don't want to have a little joy in their life. There's so many other places you can go for that negativity. No band tonight. Last several Sundays, there's been bands over here, but I guess it was a lot earlier too. Here at New York, New York, I want to be able to come here. Nice bandstand. We'll come over here one of these nights and we'll actually watch the band at New York, New York. We always start down by Treasure Island because the parking's free. Uh, if I could find some free parking on this side, we'd probably start on this side. I know they have it over at the Oyo at the Hooters. I actually just park there, go in and play one game and then you can walk for a while. Then you were a customer. Right under the Eiffel Tower here, there's the uh, Excalibur and all its glory. Saw the Ferris, not the Ferris wheel, the uh, roller coaster going at the New York, New York last time we were down here. Don't think I'd ever ride that either. I just, I'm good. I don't need that. I don't need that adventure in life. If I want that kind of adventure, I'll go play uh, 20 card Kino. Jump out here on the freeway, drive between all the big stacks of buildings. On a Sunday night in Las Vegas. Tropicana has free parking, okay, cool. That's a lot closer to the strip, easier to get to and from. Appreciate that. Still pretty busy on the roads here for Vegas on a Sunday. So if Amazon's in town, that would be a huge reason why the rooms are so expensive. Especially the last minute bookings, usually are uh, executives of businesses that uh, don't mind paying the money because they can write it off. I mean, are they mind paying the money, but they'll do it. That's one of the ways hotels yield manage their uh, revenue. Uh, it's just like airlines, as the seats sell on airliners, the hotel room sell prices go up. That's why you want to book early if you're planning to come to Vegas. Check out the English Hotel. If you actually book the English Hotel, you can send me your reservation information. I'll go in there and I will get you a discount. Unless, of course, it's over SEMA or CES or those, then there's no discounts available on those. But most times, for our cash or crash viewers, we'll have discounts available for you. And once they get that established with Marriott, we'll announce it to you put it on all of our detail information so you can always just go to marriott.com and use that corporate code for your cash or crash discount. Friday night, join us with April Brooker for First Friday. I'm guessing about 5.30 will be set up. We'll have the, uh, hopefully the man in the white pants will be there. We'll have the uh, slot machine out there. We'll have a couple of special guests from April Brooker's uh, her crew of uh, entertainers. We have Dwayne Newton coming in and also Vinny two times. Uh, right now, the hotel is scheduled for February, but probably end of February-ish, first part of March-ish. Uh, we'll get some more specific details on when the hotel opens as we get closer. Uh, more and more stuff has come in. We had some uh, pendant lamps come in. They've already been installed in the rooms. Uh, since you were there, Steve D, got some new stuff even. And then this week, we're supposed to get another container that uh, is coming off the ocean, which is the biggest furniture for the rooms, the last, last of it. Then there's a few minor knickknacks coming in. And then, of course, the restaurant being built out. Once all that's done, we're ready to open. And uh, we'll have some big grand opening par parties and celebrations after we're open. We'll do a, a soft party to start and then the big grand opening party later on. There's Area 15 to the left, another Todd English restaurant in there, the, the Beast. Fantastic food. You can look up Todd English online and see where he's, he's going to be on like Good Morning America, and the Today Show, and all that stuff coming up as he's promoting his uh, holiday menu items, as well as uh, the new hotel. It's your Todd English cookware, cook along with him at home. There's Palace Station, love the palace. Some great rooms up top there. Uh, Google says December 1st, and uh, it's not gonna happen. Uh, Google doesn't change very fast. We got people sending them information all the time, trying to update it, and uh, I was opening a place down in Tucson at the beginning of the pandemic and uh, they had my information on everything and it took almost a year and a half for the phone calls to stop coming in from all the vendors and all the different people. 
uh, that would call me and, you know, hey, are you, can you open the gate for me? I go, I, I haven't been there in a year, dude. But uh, it took Google forever to get that stuff updated as well. So I got the red. We're going to yield and then keep going forward. There's no traffic yet. Back on Sahara here. I know which jack in the box I'm going to go to. Stevie, how you doing? Good to have you here. Stevie. Somebody hit all your numbers today on a Kino machine at one of the casinos I was at, all along the top row there. It was amazing. It's only the second time I've seen all 10 numbers hit up there. Guy had six over six over six over six played, and he hit all four cards, $2,700 on it. 80 cent bet. Pretty sweet. Is W2G. There's the Ahern Casino. We're going to go in there sometime. I have a friend that works for them. Found out she's in there. Oh my goodness, there's a human being right there. It's in their accounting department, I believe, or sales department. Let's see if we can't get a special VIP tour. It's like the third person in the road and a bird today. Bird wasn't so lucky, the other three have made it. Lots of Steve's in here, yep. <laughs> We're Steve friendly. I think I told the story before. Uh, when I first got here, I went on Facebook and I invited over 500 Steve Dennis's to come stay at the hotel I was managing at the time figuring we could have like a Steve reunion, a Steve D reunion. And I didn't get one response, which I thought was interesting. I thought I'd at least get a dozen people to take me up on a free stay in Vegas, but we didn't get it. I guess it was the early days of spam. People weren't opening my emails. There's over 500 people got the invite. I think there's like 2,500 people with my name on Facebook at the time. <laughs> Are you a V like me or a PH like me? Yeah. <laughs> There's so many ways to spell Steve. Steven, Steven, Stefan. I get Stefan a lot, so I just go with it. I think it would have been a great party. I had complete uh, autonomy to do that kind of stuff at that hotel. My job was to keep it open while they sold it. And uh, initially I came out for a 30-day gig. Ended up being here almost five years. All right, another PH, yes. That's me applauding the PH. We need to get some Vs and some PHs so we have a good PH balance with the Vs. Cookies with security out front. Those are special cookies that they make. I met a guy from Wales and spoke with him a while. I told him my name and he was also Steve. He was a PH. Oh, cool. Uh, Derek P, uh, yeah, yeah, definitely can get a room because your name is real close to Steve. Unfortunately, they blew up that hotel. It's now a parking lot. <laughs> okay, here we go. I hope Jack in the Box is up. They're 24 hours, aren't they? Hope they're 24 hours. It looks abandoned down here right now. I'll get you a tent and you can stay on the grounds of the old Clarion. They look open. Kenjasan, I'm not sure uh, if that question was for me. It says, what is my vlog title? It's just Cash or Crash Las Vegas Live. That's who we are. We also do uh, Jack the Box. All right, that's the tacos. They're the only thing safe at this hour. Hey, Richard, enjoy the box. What can I get for you tonight? Can I get uh, four tacos and... Tacos. No tacos? We had 1,100 tacos on Thanksgiving. You said, oh my God. Yeah, I had to make all of them individually. Meat, cheese, lettuce, sauce. It was hell. 
Oh my goodness. So what do you recommend then? Let's talk a wish. Taco God now. <laughs> <laughs> do you have the loaded fries? Do you have those? Uh, we have the bacon cheddar loaded fries. Let's do one of those then. Alright, anything else for you? Uh, that'll be all. Gonna be... And did you want the curly or regular? Curly would be great. Alright, it's gonna be a 367 out the window. 367, fantastic. 1100 tacos on Thanksgiving. Wow! Lettuce wrap tacos. Did the uh, did the uh, protein in and out for lunch with my wife today. We both had the protein burger. There's so much lettuce on it. It was like eating a salad before I ate the burger. It's very delicious. That was in and out in Phoenix. Uh, I am getting food for the rest of you. That's why I got the uh, large size uh, loaded fries. Oh, I didn't get the nuggets. Damn. Let me see if they got nuggets. My bad. Too much time between having that conversation, getting here, you know, brain wanders. Got to put that down on the next paper plate list. Get nuggets for everybody. So while we're waiting here, uh, give me ideas for our paper plate uh, for tomorrow. I'll take I'll take suggestions right now. I got a blank blank paper plate in, in front of me. So for our eleven things tomorrow, what are eleven things we want to see? And this will be our uh, our viewers. Stop. So yeah, in and out in Phoenix. It was actually in Tempe by Arizona State University. My, uh, I was gonna say alma mater, but it's a school I was enrolled in. Steve D doesn't know what a paper plate is. Someone explained to him while I write down blue hair. Steve D, we do H A R. Then uh, feathered people. It's eleven things to look for during our broadcast. We write them down on a paper plate. Spinners. So we come up with, it's almost like a uh, scavenger hunt type thing. A group wearing bandanas. I like that group bandana wearers. You know what a paper plate is just for my reference? <laughs> well, I, want, I didn't want to break it down too minute for you. Uh, but let me show you. I'll give you an example here of what one is. So like this one is a bunch of things that I wrote on a paper plate. So those are the 11 things we'll look for in an upcoming uh, broadcast. And so as I create the one for tomorrow, I was just asking for suggestions. Doppelgangers, we can do more doppelgangers. There's a lot of them tonight. It was amazing how many doppelgangers. Eleven hundred tacos. I like the doppelgangers, those are fun. We actually saw Michael Jackson and Father Guido Sarducci tonight, John's father. <laughs> you thought Bob Dingo was strange. I don't, I don't know if we, uh, I think strange is a okay word. It's okay. We'll go with strange, different, unique. Very good. All right, are you the 1100 taco guy? Yes, sir. I'm on YouTube live, can I show you? Oh, yeah. Everyone wants to know who did the 1100 tacos, there he is. That's our guy, that's 1100 taco guy. So everyone go to Yelp, what's your first name? Wow. What's your first name? Aiden. Aiden, so go to Yelp and put in uh, Aiden and uh, 1100 tacos. Wow. There you go. Oh no, that's good, thank you so much. Appreciate it. All right. Oh, cool. All right. Be good. That's Aiden at the uh, Jack in the Box in the Arts District. 1,100 tacos. Got to give our uh, shout outs and props to everybody. People like that working hard, they need uh, their bosses to know what they do. You hung out with Dingo two nights in a row? I really want to meet him. I think he's pretty cool. I love his show. You think you went back to Phoenix? Yep, hashtag 1100 tacos or Aiden. Cause he works the night shift. So whoever the general manager, the manager of that uh, restaurant may or may not know that he did 1100 tacos. So that was sweet. A lot of people uh, posing for the camera tonight. That was really cool too. 
all different areas, different people. Appeared to be some uh, beverage consumption earlier. It was nice seeing your father, <laughs> nice seeing pops. So 30 mile an hour speed limit, that Mustang's doing at least 60, 50, 50, 60. And uh, there's a lot of cops here usually, but uh, he's getting away with it, so good for him. It's just dangerous driving these small streets like that. I'm gonna pull up to the uh, English one more time. For those of you who don't know what the English Hotel is, I'll show it to you real quick. I'll show you the uh, artwork being done. You can check back. We're gonna have some updated video tomorrow of our artists creating the uh, spray painted uh, mural on the front of the hotel. His name is Pros, spelled P-W-O-S, and uh, just doing a fantastic job. I got three videos out the other day of his work, and then we'll show you some updated stuff here. And then as it continues, they said it'll take probably two weeks for him to finish. And he works at different hours. He works in the evening, he works in the daytime. There's different lighting techniques that he uses. He's also creating a time-lapse uh, video of it. But we're right here in the Arts District, so we're uh, commissioning art from a bunch of our local artists as well. Get over here and show that to you. It's one block from where we're at. This is where First Friday is going to happen on Friday night. Be sure to come on down and check out all the action of First Friday. Plus, April Brucker will be here live on the channel. Pull up here real quick. Get you a quick peek. Pull in here for just a moment. <laughs> Cat crossing the street. This is this is where it was. Yeah. Get the button here. I'm gonna pop out real quick. Get you one more view of the artwork. So that's it right there. Oh, sorry. Got it. That's extra security we brought in to make sure nobody paints on it here. So that's the work being done by Pros. P-W-O-Z is his uh, name. It's how it's spelled. He's world famous. Uh, he was telling us there's actually warrants for his arrest in France uh, because they don't take it as kindly as we do. Look at that. Isn't that beautiful? So we'll have that kind of art all over the property along with a bunch of other local artists uh, producing art for the hotel. Uh, but I just want to share that with you here before we uh, wrap it up for the night. So thank you all for being here tonight. Uh, I'm going to jump in, go home. Got to finish my uh, food here. Appreciate you hanging out. It's been a beautiful night. Thank you for the super chats, everyone. Thanks for uh, being a part of the channel. We'll do it again tomorrow night. It's going to be a lot of fun. We're going to have uh, Monday night. So we'll be out on the strip probably tomorrow night. We'll do some things out there. Join us again. We're wrapping up November. It's our biggest month ever on YouTube. We started this a year ago, the fourth of this month just been fantastic it's been a long day started out in austin texas flew to phoenix drove up here did this tonight i'm gonna get some sleep appreciate you guys very much be sure to hit the like button on the way out if you haven't done that tell a friend and join us again uh really appreciate you being a part of the channel good night everyone and do something cool for someone uh oh cool people i hadn't seen yet i must have missed your chat earlier i apologize have a good night we'll see you all next time good night